Ali Bates had been out for a meal with friends when she began suffering a severe migraine. The mom of one from Warrington, decided to head home to sleep it off as this had helped with her migraines previously. But her symptoms progressed and, on August 7 last year, she was rushed to hospital. She told the Liverpool Echo, My partner Olivia called for an ambulance and we found out I was having a stroke. I didn't have a clue what was going on as I was so out of it. It turned out Ali had suffered a hemorrhagic stroke, a condition that occurs due to bleeding into the brain by a ruptured blood vessel. Ali had begun suffering from migraines more frequently before the stroke, and these masked any other symptoms. She never suspected it could be a stroke as she was young. According to the Stroke Association, the most typical symptom of a hemorrhagic stroke is a sudden, severe headache, sometimes called a thunderclap headache. Ali who worked as a counselor and teacher, spent two weeks in intensive care and three months in hospital. But the now 39-year-old had been left with paralysis to the left side of her body and is slowly learning to walk again. She said, there was a point last year where I was considering not carrying on. It's the little things like getting myself dressed, not being able to work. For example, with only one hand I can't put my hair up, I can't go to the toilet by myself and put clothes on myself. You can't help but go to a dark place. Ali added, I didn't want to fall into a hole and I look at what I can do rather than what I can't do. I refuse to let it get to me and I need to be there for my son Mason and my family. Doctors told Ali at the time of the stroke she had very high blood pressure. She said she was very stressed working three jobs, and checking her blood pressure was not something she thought about as she was so young. Ali now hopes to raise awareness for stroke, particularly among people of any age, as she believes adverts highlighting symptoms are stereotypically targeted at older people. She said, strokes can happen at any age and do not discriminate. The Stroke Association says people describe a thunderclap headache as the worst pain they have ever had, and like being hit on the head. The charity advises, if you or someone you know has a thunderclap headache, even if it goes away by itself or with painkillers, you should call 999. Alice's partner Olivia has now set up a GoFundMe page to raise funds for alternative treatment in America. To donate to the GoFundMe page, please click here.